All right, everybody. Accurize here. Welcome back to Frostpunk. This is the preview of uh, preview build. The game is set to be released in a few days here, April 24th. Currently, it's April 21st, so just a couple, a few days. And this is going to be episode number two of the preview series. So uh, I'm glad to see you back. If you uh, saw the last episode, well, let's get straight into it. So we have our scouts. Uh, they went out and found the lost expedition. They're bringing them back. So we're going to have some more workers here, more mouths to feed, etc., etc., all the fun and crazy things that go along with that. I'm going to go ahead and build another research center, I think, just to speed things along with our research. And I will build another hunter's hut to keep all those mouths fed. Okay. So let's do that. What we got here? They got, okay, so... Oh, that works out actually perfect. That works out real nice. Uh, could build it there. Or there. Yeah, you know what? Let's just build it over here. Let's work our way around. Um, we don't have anybody homeless. Four people are being treated. We had one death, but, you know, we're just letting things... You know, we're just gonna kind of uh, wait until it becomes epidemic before we... Uh, we do anything else. Uh, I think I want to build another medical facility because we are getting a couple engineers and I don't really want anyone else dying. And I don't have a r enough room right there, but that's okay. Got some room over here. I can throw it in there uh, if need be. Next thing I think I want to uh, research is my, if I can, I don't think I can yet. I think I have to open up the next tier down actually. I was going to say I was going to open up the range of the generator. I don't think I can do that yet though. So it, it is on my to-do list though. So that way this area here will get heated without any internal buildings. Alright, down to 770, or 716 coal, but that's okay. We can always send people out into the fields when that becomes a problem. Right now, I have 23 just kind of sitting around not doing a whole heck of a lot. Now. Um, could take the children out of the workforce and throw some adults in there. <laughs> How about we do that? How about we do that? Let's max that out. I only had five in there? Hmm, that doesn't seem right. I was missing out on some some resources, wasn't I? Mm, I don't like that. And once this gets built, we're going to go ahead and have a nice nice big hunting party heading out. And we'll just connect that road on up and spend extra cash just to make it look nice. And let's go ahead and go. So we've got our free time here at night. They're going to build these buildings. And there goes our hunting party. we got a little stockpile of food rations. I'm loving it. A workshop. We need some workers. Okay, we're gonna have to find some more. Ah, perfect. They came in just just the nick of time. I needed those engineers. Scouts from number one have returned safely to the city. Scouts have arrived with 22 workers, four children, nine engineers, and we can disband the scouts. But we really don't need the manpower. So let's just go ahead. And oh, let's watch the cutscene. Is what I meant to say. Here they come. Watch out. That first step's a doozy. All right, people from our convoys, reunions. It's heartwarming, heartwarming to see families reunited after so many hardships, but shouldn't there be other settlements nearby? The first expeditions left London long ago. They ought to be well established by now. They'll surely help us find food, uh, find our footing. Hmm. We'll look into the, we'll, we will look for the others. Okay, we'll do that. Hugs all around everybody, high fives, back slaps, fist bumps. Chest bumps. Alright. So, let's throw these uh, engineers, bam, right there, into there. And we do need to build a road there, too. I forgot about that. I did forget about it. Oh, did I build a road around the corner? I didn't mean to build a road around the corner. Can I undo that? Can I undo the road? No, it won't let me, will it? <laughs> it's like, you're getting a road whether you want it or not. I'll just build over that road if I have to. It costs me a couple extra wood. All right. Okay, so we got our scouts waiting here. Let's not have them resting on their laurels. Let's uh, observatory, a gloomy cave, or a sturdy. Let's check out the sturdy shelter. Right, it's further furthest one away too. So we're sending them on out again. What's up here? Go to city. Build an outpost depot to deploy outpost teams. So I can build outposts. It sounds like out here. Okay, we're kind of getting to the limit of. Yeah, we actually are to the limit of my experience with the game, so things might not flow quite as nicely now. Things are going to get ugly. What's this over here? What are you doing? What What are you guys doing? Are, are you guys hunting? Is that what you're doing? 
going to eat. Oh, there are the hunters on the way home, I think. Oh, we need more uh, houses, too. We got 35 homeless. Let's take care of that problem. And we have plenty of wood. Let's, let's, get, let's get these guys taken care of. And we're going to need to uh, warm them up, too, because they're going to be in the cold area. It's, we're still in the negative 40 degree range, too. One, two, three. I do know what I want to research next after this arrow. The arrows. I want to do a... Uh, Oh, the little steam, uh... Oh, they, they basically, they're little steam heaters that warm a certain area. So I can put one like right here and to keep these, these all these buildings nice and toasty. Um, we'll see. We'll see how it works. Yeah, let's go ahead and throw the overdrive on. Let's go. Let's do it. It doesn't cost more coal as far as I can tell. It just, you run the risk of blowing up your generator. Search for other others. Our people found a trail leading into the wilderness... We should try to follow it. We must find other people and ask them for help to secure our survival. Okay. Okay. Here they come back. All these people. we got a bunch of people just kind of hanging out, not doing a whole heck of a lot. I'm about to put some people out to work here as soon as the temperature goes up. But uh, in the meantime, that slowed down there, didn't it? Yep, it sure did. There we go. We're down to three rations, but we got some food from the hunt. Okay, let's pause this. I'm going to put 15 on the hunt. That leaves us with 15 available. That kind of works out nicely. So we've got a bunch of hunters. And did I hit the research? Nope, still not there yet. There it goes. There's the work day starting. And we just got upgraded on our hunter's, uh, uh, hunter's gear. So we're going to go ahead and open this up because I want to get... Actually, you know what? I want, I kind of want the steam hub. I think smaller heat zones around them. So let's do that. I need that for those houses. I think these houses are going to be cold. The tent. Yeah, they're chilly, whereas these are livable. So I don't want these people getting sick who are living down here. That's why I'm doing the steam hub. Okay, I might do another medical tent too. Since we have, how are we doing on engineers? We've got a bunch of kids. We've got four engineers. Yeah, let's do that. Medical post. Throw that out there too. And we'll fill it with engineers. Let's get started here. Keep on gathering. I think we're out of, yeah, we are out of resources there. Let's get rid of that. And what we're going to need to do is we're going to need to research a uh, sawmill pretty quick. We have a gathering post only gathering wood crates there. So I need to take these 10 people that I just got rid of here and we need to start gathering. Oh, there is no more wood, is there? Okay. Well, we'll have them go out and grab coal. It is, it's no longer super cold. I mean, it is pretty freaking cold, but it's no longer the cold spell that we just had so let's throw those people out there um, the engineers are going to go in here kids you know what hey you guys got to go out and earn earn your keep now now that it's warmed up a little bit oh turn off the overdrive yes thank you thank you thank you there we go Whew. glad I saw that message okay what we got here medical post we're going to throw our engineers in there is that all of our engineers yeah I'll probably take one out of research, put them in the medical post. I'd rather have people healthy than worry about being super fast with all my research. What we got here? Medical post. Oh, I don't have any more. Wait, I had two medical posts already? Oh yeah, I guess I did. Okay, well we got three now, so we are going to be like the most healthy, or at least well treated population in existence. Okay, and we can always tear this down too if we need it. No gatherable resources in range. We might as well just get rid of it. Bada boom. And uh, dismantling. I don't know if we get anything back from it or not. Have to keep an eye on that. And then over here, do we have uh, anything in range? Yeah, we still do. We still got 25 trees left back here. Okay. So we will definitely need to. Once this gets done researching, we're going to definitely need to research Sawmill next, for sure. 
And we got some grave. Three homeless. Steam hub research. Nice. Nice. Okay, so we're going to build that real quick here. Steam hub. And you guys will see. See how that warms up that whole area there? If I put it there, it's going to hit a good amount of the buildings. So we're going to do that right there. Okay. Then we don't have any engineers to put in there, but that's alright. We'll get there. We'll get there. This is uh, chilly, but low risk of getting ill inside the medical, inside the hospital. Yeah, it's a breeding ground. That one's nice and warm. That one, we'll turn that one on for now. And we got the heater on. And uh, that's nice and warm. That one's nice and warm. Research goal not set. Good point. Good point. Sawmill. Start that bad boy. Get it, get it, get it. Okay. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. And then we're shooting up with the coal again. Perfect. We need, we need more hunters, man. Cookhouse, close this time of day. Yeah, yeah, I got you. We're going to actually extend you out now. Eh, no, we won't. No, we won't. Because we cook faster than we can keep rations anyway, so it's not a big deal. Okay. That's free time for now. Oh, there we go. How did I only get one food? My guy's not going out? What's going on here? Or they just suck at hunting? Alright. Oh, we got 74 food rations. Okay. They must just be converting it super fast. I didn't even notice that over there. Sawmill research. Okay, let's pause that. Do a new research. I'm going to open up this one down here. Upgrade it 50 trees. <laughs> we need to build a sawmill. Hopefully, I left enough for sawmill. We'll see. Ten wood. Yeah, we can do that. We can manage. We manage that. We're gonna put it in. If you put it on top of the trees, it 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 could destroy some of the resources. We don't want to do that. Um, I think what I want to kind of do is tuck it in. No, it's it, it, what, it's, what it's destroying is that tiny little those stumps right there. I don't think that's a big deal. All right, let's just do it right there. Looks good to me. I know it's not. It did destroy a little bit of something, but not that worried about it. We're gonna take a road and shoot that road straight out to it, and then we will staff that thing. Toot sweet. And we are out of. Resources here, inoperative. Zero resources, let's tear that thing down. Okay, let's go. We're gonna build that road right out there. Coal pile depleted, so we lost a coal pile, which means we've got 25 workers now. Uh, child injured at work. Give the kid the day off, fine. Give him the day off. Okay, I think, uh, let's see here. Yeah, we're gonna get up to about 800 and then I'll maybe 850 and then I'll get the kids out of the fields unburied corpses okay a few of our people have fallen ill after coming in contact with a decomposing body this will happen if you have no way to dispose of the dead so what we'll do is we'll build ourselves a cemetery we're gonna have to uh... well corpse disposal is new building is a snow pit no risk of getting disease from unburied bodies I like that Bodies are preserved for potential future use. Interesting. Hmm. I kind of am intrigued by that. You will have to dig a snow pit. I don't have a problem with that. I won't do it. I mean, the kids will. I won't. Because we'll just say, hey, let's go make an igloo. And you guys got to dig really deep. And that's how you're supposed to do it. And they'll, they'll love it. It'll be fun. They'll have a freaking snowball fight and everything. You know, maybe throw, throw an occasional eyeball by accident. Hope will fall. Discontent will rise. Versus a cemetery. New building cemetery. Hope will rise slightly. No risk of getting disease from unburied bodies. Uh, each burial will keep some people from work for a few hours. You have to establish a cemetery. Hmm. Takes 10 wood. I kind of... I, I, I kind of... Ooh, organ transplants. Trans 
Oh, we can save people. We can save people. For science! I hope one down. <laughs> Hope's like, oh, dang it. I really don't want an organ trend. You guys gotta see long, long ball. You gotta play long ball, guys. Alright, so let's get people on this right away. Boom. And let's put people in here right away. Boom. I don't have enough. I don't have enough. What do I need? Engineers? Oh, that's right. That's the that's the uh, the unused building. I got my scouts out here just hanging out, waiting. I wish it'd be a little more visible. I mean, I got so much going on. Okay. You guys gonna need to speak up. Send me a freaking carrier pigeon or something. Shelter was well supplies and built will stand even the worst weather. An advanced steam heating system protects it from the cold. Interesting. Explore. The trail leads to another city. This shelter is comfortable and well equipped with emergency supplies. There's a notice posted by the heavy round door. All to all scientists, if you use any supplies, remember to notify the quartermaster upon your return to the city. This means there's another city out there. A signpost by the trail points two different directions. London. 1934 miles that way and home 27 miles site discovered a ski steel bridge so take resources resources will be taken there's 99 food 192 wood and a steam uh, oh god whatever it's called uh, can't remember what the name of this is <laughs> I'll tell you here in a second steam core <laughs> okay um, yeah let's head on over to steel bridge see what's going on yeah, send us out there to learn about this place. Yeah, let's do that. Can we do it? Why aren't they going? Scouts. Go to the steel bridge. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. As if I could send any other scouts. Come on. At the moment. And we need to turn the heat up on that thing. Do we? Hold on, do we? I don't think we do. We're going to extend the hours on that sawmill, though. For sure. They can be dis discontent all they want. To their hearts, con to their hearts discontent. What we got here? Cookhouse? What's going on? What's what's the matter? What's what's You're not Oh it requires raw, raw food. I got you, I got you, I got you. You got twenty five food. You're fine, you're fine. Don't worry about it. No worries. Um what else needs attention? Anything else? Add a research project. Oh yes, okay, coal mining. Uh sawmill upgrade. Allows us to introduce workplace improvements that will raise the efficiency of all sawmills and steam sawmills by twenty five. That's a lot. For ten steel quite a bit a wall drill so this drills into the wall of the crater uncovering trees that once formed a forest before the ice engulfed and provides up to 160 wood per standard workday that sounds like it's going to last forever like never ending supply of wood and we got some food options here food and okay we got the hot house which will provide us with a lot of food and yeah, but it does take a steam core mm, we only have one I think our hunters are doing an okay job now. If we get hungry, we might go that route. Or we might do soup rations or sawdust rations. No, I can't afford the sawdust. It costs too much wood. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, medical post upgrade. Oh, I don't think it costs any wood to actually do saw sawdust in your in your rations. Um, make sure to improve medical methods. People employed in the medical posts will heal the sick 10% faster. Not really about worried about that. Uh, bunkhouse. Oh, that'd be good. Dwell and protect, protect from the weather. And they cost 20 and 10. I can start replacing the tents that I have with bunkhouses. Uh, yeah. Now let's see what else we got. More scouts. Don't really need more scouts at this moment. Ah, range upgrade. Okay. Allows us to turn it up the generator range and extend its heating zone. Full used by the generator is doubled when the settings in use. Okay. I think what I need most is the sawmill upgrade, honestly. Cause I'm yeah, let's do that. Let's do that one. How we doing over here? We got people working. 4.8 per hour. Per hour per hour. Okay, I got 29 left. I might do another sawmill. Where I want to do up here? Yeah, let's think. Hmm. This one's the big one down here. Oh yeah, okay. I'm back. I'm back to the raw food again. How many times I'm gonna look at that? Um. Now we gotta wait 18 hours to sign a new law. I think I might do another sawmill. Put some of these people to work. 
That could bounce in between the sawmill and the... That's a, that's a coal. That's for coal mining right there. I think I'm going to do it. Like, how in the world do you get back in there? Jeez. How much... Not adjacent to street. I'm okay with that. Yeah, let's do that. That way I don't have to worry about the sawmill stuff going on. I only got four wood. That's okay. Let's uh, let's advance time. We should be getting much more wood here shortly. Oh, yeah. Let's let's build that. I did want to build the... Uh, where was it? I do want to build the... Uh, can't, I can't issue a law yet, can I? Gotta wait 10 hours. I want to build the snow pit. Okay. Now that we got that done, let's build a road. Pause this. Build a road. There we go. Good enough. You guys can work on it at night. Oh, street building. I'm wondering why it was paused. I was like, it's street building view. That's the problem. Let's turn that on. Make these people comfy. They're comfy. They're comfy. What's going on up here? Protective mother. Mother has refused to let her daughter go to work. Oh yeah, again, I'm afraid she's going to get injured. Good luck. Could look the other way this time, but others might see it as unfair. We won't make an exception. Hope will rise slightly. Uh, we really don't need the work force, so I guess so. We want hope to rise slightly. Gosh darn it. Okay. Hopefully my hunters are working their butts off. Hunting. At least one's still out there hunting. Guy who hasn't found anything yet. And they're all, all of these people are all going home. Okay. Alright, we're waiting for orders again. Okay. Explore. What we got here? We stopped at the edge of a deep, wide ravine, marveling at the steel bridge spanning it. Even more so, a huge uh, automation. Uh, automaton. <laughs> Sorry. Sweeping the snow from the roadway. It would. Oh, yeah, there he is. Okay. I didn't see him. Uh, it would be possible to send the machine back to the city or disassemble it for resources. Hmm, jeez, let's think. Hmm, do I want a robot that can do everything for me? Or do I want to just take it apart and then have to do everything myself anyway? Sites discovered, weather station, a large convoy. Large convoy, really? Uh, send it to the city, dude. I want my yeah, I want my I want my robot. Uh, automaton sent to the city. We re reprogrammed the automaton and sent it on its way. It disappeared in the distance, walking steadily towards our city. Uh, the first whiffs of snow started to settle on the bridge. What does that mean? Weather station, large convoy. A weather station might be useful. <laughs> I have a feeling that might be useful. Um, let's hit the large convoy. I want to talk to see what. There were vehicles and tents. We could see people moving between them. Smoke rising from the campfire. Yeah, let's go check that out first. And then we can head on. We can hit this one and then head on back. I think. Because we still have the resources. Search for others, find other settlement, and snow pit provide a place for the dead, so we still need to do that. Alright, let's get back in here. What's going on here? Search for the other cities, deserted bridge. Finding the bridge in, to winter home prov proved that we were on the right track, but raised questions. Why was the bridge deserted? Why wasn't <laughs> why wasn't manned by a troll? Why wasn't the uh, uh, automaton under the care of an engineer? There are logical explanations to all. But people are giving growing anxious. We'll f hope falls slightly. We'll find out in winter home. Man, I figured hope would go up with that news. I'm, I got a freaking robot coming back to you to do stuff for you, and I found a bridge, and I'm, which indicates life. I mean, come on. It's so freaking picky out here. All right, so we got 41. We're gonna turn into 82 rations come morning. Uh, three homeless. Actually, I do need to build another house, don't I? 
Well, let's see here. Ooh, a snow pit. I can build it here. Oh, I didn't know I could build a snow pit. Like that. Yeah, let's do that. Just build it right in the ghetto. <laughs> the snow pit. I don't know. I don't think it needs to be. Yeah. Well, let's let's put it. We got our. We don't want it around our food facilities, right? We'll put it near our research center since we're gonna take all the pe body pieces or pieces of the body in there anyway, probably. Right. All right. So let's do that. Keep it away from our general public. Okay, you let the work shift, shot st work shift start. There we go. Rations are shooting up quickly. There we go. We're up to 71 rations, 67. Snow pit established. Nice. Go look at it. It's the easiest way to dispose of the dead, but you'll have to keep the heat zones away, or else they'll start to rot. I wish they would have told me that to begin with. Body stored here can be used for parts of, of the organ transplant law, if the, if the organ transplant law is... is uh, Fine, so there's the body count. Had I known that, I probably would have moved it way out into the boonies. But come on now. I should have moved it over here. I should just put it way out here. Oh, fine. Okay. Medical post. Uh, we don't have any engineers, really, that we can afford to spare. We have anything there? Nope. Don't need to look at that. And we're about less than an hour away from being able to sign a new law. Yeah, things are going pretty good for us, I think. Plenty of coal, decent amount of wood. Oh, we need to sign some people here. What am I doing? Get to work. I forgot about that one all the way up there. It's off the screen. I didn't even wasn't even seeing it. Okay. And let's get that that warmed up. I don't want people getting sick. And let's extend those hour, hours out. Your, your hours are extended. It's only fair. If you're going to work extra hours, so are they. Um, research? Yeah, I want you working extra hours. Uh, Hunter's Hut? I can't. I wish I could make them hunt longer. But I can't, alas. Um, okay, let's keep going. Let's go an hour and see what I can research now. There we go. Hope and discontent. What's going on here? Oh, here's an, a, a little timeline of how, how the normal schedule works. 12 to 6 is your sleepy time. 6 to 8 is when you're kind of waking up, free time, having your coffee, reading your paper. 8 to 6, yeah, depends on the... Depends on if you work extended hours or not, and then you have free time there. Okay. There's more. There's more. Generator overdrive already covered all that. Hoping discontent. So when they're not, people's needs aren't met. Uh, discontent rises. The laws, buildings, ability. I think we've pretty much covered all that. Nothing really new there. What's going on here? Preventing disease. People can come ill if they come into contact with decomposing bodies. It's time to decide what to do. Remains over deceased. All right. Didn't I already, didn't I already do that? Corpse disposal? Yeah, we can do organ transplants. Uh, we can use the part, body parts of our deceased to save lives and he accelerate healing the way the dead can continue contributing to survival of the city. After this, introducing this law, another one can't be passed for, okay. Sick recover faster. Yeah, do that. Organ fertilizer? Organic fertilizer? Is that what it was? The next one, I think? Okay. Uh, didn't really change anything. Discontent's not bad. Hope's not bad. And I do want to build that extra house, so let's get going on that. Uh, do I want to just start doing with new houses? I think... Oh, I haven't researched it yet. I'm not quite there yet. Sawmill upgrade. Okay. Let's just build them a regular house for now. They have somewhere to lay their head. Oh, heat map. Ugh, not that good. And what about... This guy down here, isn't there a... Yeah, this one. What's he hitting? In that whole area. I don't think I'm going to be close enough. With my house. It's going to be a chilly house. Alright. Good enough. At least I'll have somewhere. It's better than sleeping. Well, I don't know. It'll probably be better sleeping next to that warm generator. But we'll see. We'll see what they choose to do. So there we go. We got our wood is flying up. Upgrades increase. We should be getting 25% more wood now. And let's go ahead and do a re new research goal. What do we want to do? What do we want to do? Eating? Yeah, let's do range upgrade. <laughs> Alright, let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. Might have to send some people out to the mines a little more often now. And, uh... I'm only too hungry. I kind of want to do another hunting thing, but then I think I might do 
Um, I might do the uh, hothouse. It actually grows some vegetables and things like that. It's basically a greenhouse. Oh man, I wish I hadn't put that there. I kind of think I should destroy it. How much is a snow pit? Cost none. Put another one? I can just put it anywhere? Oh, yeah, let's put it out in the middle of freaking nowhere. Yeah, I'll make it adjacent to the street, don't you worry. There we go. Let's get rid of this one. Get rid of that one. Oh, I can't demolish the last snow pit. So I need to build this one first, and then I can demolish the other one. I got you. I got you. I'm even putting it off the road. <laughs> Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Let me move it over a couple. Badoom. Da -da -da -da. Snow pit. Boom over one, two. I should draw out my. I should draw out my road first. That would be the smart thing. Dang it. Yes, that would have been the smart thing. I'm just <laughs> cut. I know how to get rid of the snow. I just figured it out. I beat your stupid game. All right, now I'm just kidding. This is a lovely game. Oh, I did. Did I just do the same thing again? Oh my gosh. Geez. Okay, forget this. I'm gonna do what I said I should have done like four attempts ago. Okay, nice straight road. There we go. Now let's build that snow pit. Wait, is it? It will be. It will be adjacent to the street. Street under construction. Okay, so that should be acceptable. Right there. Right there. All right, you guys get to work on that. Make it so. Are my guys just waiting? Oh, they are. Oh, I caught them right at that at the exact moment they started to wait. So good that time. Um, this convoy carrying work is a this is a convoy carrying workers that got lost in the blizzard. They are weak and have no provisions. We should listen to their story and escort them to our city. Survivors, search the area. They sought the large convoy. They sought winter homes. So they were looking for the same place we were. The workers who were riding in this convoy told us they were heading to the city of Winterhome. We were supposed to fall, follow the signal from the beacon, but we couldn't pick it up, they say. We tried to follow a search pattern to find it, but we ran out of fuel. Escort the survivors to the city. Wow, that's a lot of engineers, man. Um, send them to the city. 26, wow, okay. And leave the survivors to their fate. Without knowledge of how to get to the city, the survivors will die trying to find it. Okay, let's not do that. Let's uh, let's escort them because I'm coming back anyway. Because I wanted to come back anyway. I was going to check out the weather station, but we'll check that out after our return trip. So we're going to be back in 20 hours. And uh, looks like we're going to get our robot here in about a day. Five hours. All right, guys. Well, we're past the 30-minute uh, mark, so we have just rescued a bunch of lost survivors. We built ourselves a nice little... Uh, Oh, we built two snow pits. I'm about to destroy one. Um, and things are looking pretty good for us. We've got a decent amount of food. I'm probably going to put a lot more people on the hunting duty. Um, I think that's what I want to do. These, these new people coming in, they're going to all be going out to hunt. And uh, we'll go from there. So like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification bell if you do subscribe. So you get alerted whenever I drop new videos. And uh, I look forward to seeing you guys in the next episode of this preview of Frostpunk. Thank you so much for watching.